A third person has died in Connecticut as a result of the heavy rain that caused road washouts and bridge destruction, leaving drivers stranded in raging floodwaters earlier this week. Fairfield officers were notified Thursday afternoon by a neighboring police department of a vehicle submerged in the Aspetuck River, directly behind Aspetuck Falls in Fairfield. The vehicle was believed to have been at this location for several days and was found to be unoccupied, authorities said. When the police arrived, they found the car empty. A diver from Fairfield Police also confirmed that no one was inside the car or in the nearby water. Further investigation indicated that the driver might have been in the car when it went into the water. This is is crazy. How high? Just imagine how high. Somehow somehow we're we're in here, but you can just see how high it is. Unbelievable. Just the amount of power that is going through this thing right now. It's just insane. And you see, there's just tons of people. Tons of people that are just all lined up there. Oh, there's the house. There's another one. There's another one that just went down. That whole thing. Oh, that the, the stairs are gone. The stairs are going from there. Oh my God. During the early hours of Monday, a heavy rain fell on the municipality of Hamai, Jalisco, which caused strong water currents and floods in the streets of the town, leaving various material effects. Through social networks, users shared videos and images of the high levels of water that were generated in various streets of the municipality. However, at the time of writing this note, Civil Protection Jalisco has not issued official information in this regard. On the evening of Monday, August 19th, heavy rain as promised reached Vladivostok. Flooded roads, buses, entrances, parking, and shopping centers, drowned cars, and pedestrian crossings. The rivers went out of the coast, and the bridges were filled with water to the brim. Dramatic footage showed tourists running in terror as water spouts struck beach resorts in southern Italy. Video shows a vortex striking a beach in the Campania region, north of Sicily, on Monday, sending umbrellas and heavy debris flying as people fled. <laughs> Some flooding in Tokyo, Japan. Lightning continued to prevent planes from taking off at Haneda Airport.
flooding in Al Madinah, Saudi Arabia, stranded some vehicles with people on it in the flood waters. A volcano erupted Thursday in southwestern Iceland, the sixth eruption since late last year, Icelandic officials said, as the nearby town of Grindavik, which has largely remained empty since earlier eruptions, and a world-renowned geothermal spa were evacuated once again. Big retaining wall collapses in Vladivostok, Russia. According to reports, there are no injuries, but seven cars are buried, presumably because of the previous heavy rain. An investigation as to the cause is underway. Severe wind gusts and hail pummeled the commune of Gaylac in Tarn department near Toulouse in France. In addition to the material damage caused to cars and roofs, it is feared that vineyards were damaged by these violent storms as well. Thirteen people were killed on Sunday after a flash flood triggered by torrential rainfall hit Indonesia's Ternate Island in its east. 